How's your day going so far? Mine is going pretty good. I was kind of kind of on under the weather yesterday, and I took some uh, diphenhydramine. That's uh, allergy medicine. So <coughs> I usually don't take anything, but I was feeling bad. But anyway, I'm feeling better today, but still not 100%. So I have an unboxing. Got another kitchen gadget, y'all. It came yesterday. Heavy. Let me get it out the box from the floor. Uh, this is what I get. Have the dash. No mess waffle maker. It's 1200 watts. It has overflow channels. So I've seen the little dash, you know, the little ones, they about big as your hand. And you can make one waffle, but I didn't want that. I wanted something big. See how it looks. It makes four waffles. And then it has to overflow channels. If I put too much batter in, it'll overflow onto the sides. And you can even eat those little things. Okay, let's get in it. I like to unbox stuff on camera just in case it comes cracked or broken. I'm about to break my table. Well, can't have that. Well, let's pack it up nicely. How long this cord is. It's this two feet, two foot cord. You open this. Okay, it's a little level under here. You press to open it. Look at this. Okay. And these, uh, what you call these? These things, they don't come out. So, it's supposed to be no stick finish, but I'm going to probably butter it each time I use it. I'll see. And these are the overflow channels. They're pretty deep. And like I said, whatever overflows goes in these channels. And it will cook. So you can just eat it too. <laughs> nice. Has a red and a green indicator light, so I will soon find out what they're for. Okay, I'll see something right away. One of the rubber <clears throat> stopper feet is not on here. That's something minor, but I do have extra from the bottom of my. Uh, laptop that would probably fit. No Mess Waffle Maker by Dash. Household use only. And it's UL listed. And 1200 watts. 
So I like the way it looks. It has good weight to it. It weighs about eight pounds, I think. And I think, okay, so it's a space saving design. I'm thinking I can store it upright. Yeah, because it has this nice base. So I can store it upright beside my other kitchen gadgets. So I don't have to lay it this way to store it. So I like that. Nice feature. And it looks like a two foot cord. That'd be 12 inches, and that's another 12 inches, yeah. And there's a lever under here that you can unlatch to open it. Okay. I think it's supposed to be a Belgian waffle. Okay, on line it said Belgian waffle maker, but this looks like a regular waffle maker. Well, that's okay. So, you all will see me make some chicken and waffles and other stuff. And it came with this. What is that? The recipes in here? Register your product. So I get to register this, double your product warranty by registering it. Well, it has recipes in here too. Plus instructions on how to use it. It tells you to use a spray. It says spray both cooking surfaces. That's the top and the bottom. Or grease lightly with butter. That's what I plan on doing. Unless I can find the spray butter. I've had some before. Because I don't want the aerosol spray. Because it just messes up a finish. Indicator lights red and green. No stick feet. No stick feet. Non-stick feet, okay. And one of my things is done, so. If I, if my uh, laptop feet, oh, I see it's in the box. Here it is. Okay, I'll put that in here later. Okay. So it don't slide on the counter, I guess. So, so far I'm liking it. I got it from Amazon. And I will leave a link in my description box. So, if any of you are wondering where I got it, please check the description box. And I have to use like a, a silicone or a plastic spatula to get the waffle off of here when it's done. So I'll read this later. Like I said, this is by Dash. The same makers of them tiny waffle makers. But the tiny one wouldn't do nothing for me. <laughs> so I'm trying to get my thumbnail now. And I think I can also wind the cord around that base. Yes, yes, yes. So the cord won't be everywhere while I'm trying to store this. Okay, I want to thank you all for watching. Leave me a thumbs up, leave a nice comment, and subscribe to my channel. And you all have a very blessed day. Okay, bye.